The 777 flight crew oxygen system is a gaseous system similar to those on other Boeing airplanes. Let's look at how to check the status of the flight crew oxygen system. Display the status display. Flight crew oxygen pressure displays here. A blank oxygen pressure display indicates that a pressure signal is not present or the signal is invalid. If pressure in the crew oxygen system drops below a predetermined level, the crew oxygen low advisory message displays on the ICAS. This advisory message is for crew awareness. Passenger oxygen is provided by individual chemical oxygen generators located in the passenger service unit above each seat group. Passenger oxygen is also available at each flight attendant seat location and at each lavatory throughout the cabin. Passenger oxygen masks deploy automatically if cabin altitude reaches approximately 13,500 feet. The passenger oxygen masks can also be deployed manually from the flight deck. To deploy. To intentionally activate the system, raise the switch guard and push the passenger oxygen switch. Activate the passenger oxygen system. Pulling on one mask activates all masks in the unit. If a passenger oxygen mask compartment fails to open as commanded, inserting a small object such as a pen or a hairpin into this hole releases the door. The door opens and all oxygen masks deploy. The passenger oxygen on advisory message appears when the passenger oxygen masks automatically deploy or if activated by the passenger oxygen switch on the flight deck. The passenger oxygen on advisory message is for crew awareness. The 777 emergency lighting system is powered by various remote battery power supplies. Battery charge is maintained by the airplane electrical system. Cross aisle area lights and exit signs on the ceiling and sidewall panels at all exit doors. Exterior emergency lighting consists of escape slide lights. The emergency lights can be controlled from a flight attendant switch panel or by a guarded three position switch on the overhead panel. Raise the emergency lights switch guard. Turn off the emergency lights system. In the off position, the emergency lights system is deactivated. This prevents the emergency lights from coming on when airplane electrical power is removed. The airplane is normally operated with the switch guard closed. Closing the guard places the switch in the armed position. In the armed position, all emergency lights automatically illuminate if main DC electrical power is lost. Remote battery power supplies power to the lights for approximately 15 minutes. Raising the switch guard and selecting the switch to on manually activates all interior and exterior emergency lights. The emergency lights advisory message will appear for any one of the following situations. Left and right main DC electrical power is available and the emergency lights switch is selected to the off position or the emergency lights have been selected on by the pilot or the emergency lights switch is selected to the armed position and the emergency lights have been turned on at a flight attendant switch panel. 
The windows are similar, so let's only look at operation of the first officer's side window. This placard illustrates window operation. This lever locks and unlocks the window. Unlock the first officer's side window. When the lever is unlocked, an orange indicating band is visible. A hand crank is rotated to open the window. Open the first officer's side window. Touch the highlighted area. You may operate the side windows in flight only if the airplane is unpressurized and if speed is below VREF plus 80. If the windows are opened above this speed, force required to close the windows increases greatly. A placard is fully visible when the window is open, partially visible if the window is not completely closed, and completely hidden from view when the window is fully closed. Lock the first officer's side window. Once locked, Make sure that the orange indicating band is hidden from view. If the captain's side window is not closed and locked, the window flight deck left advisory message displays on ICAS. The window flight deck right advisory message displays if the first officer's side window is not closed and locked. If both of the side windows are open or unlocked, the Windows Advisory message displays on ICAS. Emergency equipment is available on the flight deck. The exact type and location of the flight deck emergency equipment may vary depending on the operator. Emergency equipment is also available and stowed throughout the cabin. The exact type and location of cabin emergency equipment also varies depending on the operator. Both flight deck and cabin emergency equipment should be available in good condition and properly stowed for each flight. In an emergency, you can escape from the flight deck through the flight deck door or through the captain's and first officer's side windows. Escape ropes stowed overhead are provided for evacuation of the flight deck. The evacuation signal system may be operated from a flight attendant switch panel at these locations. It may also be operated from an evacuation panel on the aft aisle stand. The flight deck panel has a guarded two-position command switch that activates the evacuation signal at all locations. Raise the command switch guard. Activate the evacuation signal. In addition to the oral evacuation signal, the evacuation light flashes at all locations. Pull the horn shutoff switch to turn off the oral evacuation signal. The horn shutoff switch only silences the oral signal at this panel. The evacuation light continues to flash. Close the command switch guard. Touch the highlighted area. Closing the switch guard extinguishes the evacuation light and silences the audio evacuation signal at all locations throughout the airplane. During pre-flight checks, confirm that the command switch guard is closed, the evacuation light is off, and the audio signal is silent. You are performing pre-flight checks of the flight deck. Check crew oxygen system status. Activate the passenger oxygen system. Activate the emergency lights. Continue.
Activate the evacuation signal. Continue.